chosen ones. They want to be like you. They want to be happy like you. They want to smile. They want to progress. They want to be free. They want to not care what people think. You know, Every, all of these traits that you have, they want to emulate. They want to get to that level. That's why they're mad at you. That's why they envy you. That's what we're going to talk about today's video. Now, before I get started, you already know what to do. Smash the like button, hit the red subscribe button, and leave a comment down below if you can relate. You know what I'm saying? So, let's get into it, man. Chosen ones. Shout out to all the chosen ones. They want to be like you. I'm telling you, bro. They, they wish they had the confidence. They wish they had the same, like, swag, the same, everything about you. It's just, it's just hurting them, you know? They, they hate you because they hate themselves and that. They hate you because they want to be like you and that. That's the truth. That's the real truth and that. They wish they could get to that stage. Now, the first thing that they don't notice about you is your mindset. They realize that, what this guy is so has such a positive mindset. This guy's constantly progressing. He's constantly just elevating his way of thinking. And he's just, he's just fixed and he's just very, very focused on what he's doing and that. You know, he's not bothered about what any, anyone else is doing. He's not watching anyone. He, he don't care about what's going around the world. He simply just focuses on himself and that. And they want to also get to that stage. You know, you have to feel a little bit of empathy for them. You know, because at the end of the day, it's like you're a different specimen. You're different. You're caught from a different cloth and that. So when someone is like, I don't want to say behind, but someone is like not quite at your level, they want to, obviously they're looking up like, wow, like, you know, I want to get there. So naturally you have to have some empathy for them and that, you know, some love. You have to show them love and that because at the end of the day, you know, we all know what it's like to be down bad and struggling. You feel what I'm saying to you? So the mindset, man, they, they, they wish they had it. You know, I always tell you guys, like, you have to spread the knowledge and spread the wisdom. And the whole point of progressing or being enlightened is not just to keep it and just level up and just leave everyone behind. You know, anytime you can drop some gems and that, just drop it, man. Drop the gems here and there, you know, sprinkle it around and that. The people who catch it, then cool. The people who don't catch it, then that's cool as well. You know, at least you've you done your bit. You feel what I'm saying to you? Every time you overcome yourself, you have to leave a, a blueprint for the next man to climb. You know, but really, they're trying to get there. You know, and they see you progressing, man. They see the physique. I know they're watching. They see the physique. The muscles are getting stronger. The knowledge, you know, is getting, I'm getting wiser. Everything is just, is happening, you know. You're not fighting. You're not anxious about the future. You're not anxious about money. You're not anxious about anything. You're just free from concern and that, which is ultimately what everyone else wants. They want to be free from concern. And the way you carry yourself, the way you speak, and everything about you, they can feel it. Like, wow, this guy he doesn't even, he's unfazed by life, like, you know? So we have to, again, you know, show some empathy, man, and show them the way, <laughs> you know? This ain't like you vs them, or like, oh, chosen ones vs the rest of the world. Nah, this is a chosen, everyone's in, on the same page, you know? If you're climbing, everyone has to, has to climb as well. You understand? Now, another thing they're gonna realize and they want to emulate is the energy. They always wonder why is this guy so so happy? Why is this guy got some aura? Why, why am I when I'm next to this guy? I feel good. They feel good around you. But some people don't feel good because you see negativity. They say negative people like to be around negative people. When things are going not going well in their life, they want to be surrounded by other people who are also not think not going well in their life, so they can have a conversation like, oh yeah, things not working out. I haven't got no money, and yeah, you know, so and so died, and you know, when when you're in that low frequency, you want to attract people with that low frequency, you know. So when they're around you, your energy level is higher. You know, whenever whenever people talk about negativity, you quickly transform that and show them the positive. You know, you're always quick to change the way they think. Everyone's talking about negative, you're here to bring the positive light to it. And they keep and that, that bothers people, you know, that, that makes them a bit envious. You know, why is this guy always positive? Someone died, he's still positive. You know, lost a job, still positive. No money, still positive. So when a person is low, they they like it, but they also it bothers them that the fact that they are not quite there yet. You know, it's a bit which is a big, big thing. You know, if you're a chosen one, you know what I'm saying already, man. Everyone's trying to, people trying to come with a negative, you, you come with a positive and that. They try to show how bad something is, you try to show them how good something is. They're coming from this perspective, you're showing them another perspective. You know, that's why they want to be like you, my man. I, they say, they even say it, they even tell you most of the time, that like, I want, man, I wish I had that mindset. Man, you're so positive. Man, you just, you know what I'm saying to you? So again, empathy, love, you know, guide them, show them which way, which way to go, which book to read or which, how to see things, you know, it's all about guidance, you know, end of the day, you know, you know, you're trying to do God's work and that, you know, anointed, the anointed ones and that, you know, we're trying to just guide people. So don't feel arrogant, you know, don't feel like, yeah, I'm here, I'm, you know, I'm rising and that. No, it's simply like, look, 
Look at it this way. You see, I'm at a stage in my life where like, I'm on phase, bro. <laughs> I don't care what happens, bro. If I go into poverty, I don't even care, bro. If I die, I don't even care. Not in the sense that I don't care, but I'm just on phase, bro. I accept my fate. I accept my destiny. All I, all I know is that I can only do my best, you know, control myself and make the right decisions. And that's it. What's meant for me is meant for me. What's not is not. There's no point fighting it. <laughs> There's no point fighting your destiny. There's no point fighting where you are. You see, a lot of anxiety and depression comes from not accepting your current situation. If you're at work right now, you're a worker, but that's what you're supposed to be at this moment in time. If you're broke right now, you're supposed to be broke at this time, bro. You know what I'm saying? So that's what it is. I don't fight it like I'm broke. No, I'm not supposed to be here. No, you're supposed to be where you are right now. You understand? Shout out to the chosen ones. You know what I'm talking about. You know? And the main thing they're going to see is what? They're going to see your discipline. This guy's always in the gym, bro. Every single day, I see this guy in the gym. Every single day, he's reading his books. Every single day, he's posting his videos. Every single day, like, how is he, how is he tapped into this flow state? You see? Once you, once you do something for a period of time, you head, enter the flow state. Now, the flow state, for those who don't understand, is a state where it's, you're doing things unconsciously. You see when you wake up and you get your toothbrush, you're brushing your teeth like, uh, 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 you're not thinking, oh, uh, shall I brush my teeth today? Uh, shall I brush it later? You simply go, you get your toothbrush, you brush your teeth, and then keep it pushing. Same when you enter the flow state with anything, like the gym. Like, I'm, I'm in a flow state in the gym. I wake up, boom, I pack my, I eat my breakfast and I pack my bag, boom, I'm in the gym, I'm pushing. <laughs> You know what I'm saying to I'm pushing P, you know what I'm saying to I'm pushing the weights and that. I'm not thinking, should I go to the gym today? Should I not go to the gym? Oh, I feel a bit tired today. Like I'm I'm flowing. Same with the videos. I'm not thinking, ah, should I make a video today on YouTube or not? No, I just simply boom, I got my phone, got a camera, tripod, boom, select, pick the topic, a topic, da -da -da, flowing, post, whoosh. <laughs> I ain't even thinking. <laughs> I'm flowing. You feel what I'm saying to you? So the flow state is very admirable because like it's effortless. You make things look effortless. You know? So when you're in that flow state, again, people will see and be like, yo, I want to be like this guy, but how's this guy just going to... Again, like I said, it's all love. Everything's love. We're coming from a love. We're not coming from hate. We're not coming from certain to prove. We ain't enough to prove. We're here to help people. So when someone comes and like, like uh, people come to me in the gym and ask me like, yo, what? I, I, bro, I'm here for... <laughs> you can DM me on Instagram. Anyone who's DM me on Instagram, bro, I'll reply back, bro. Anyone ask me what, what to eat, I'll, I'll, get, I'll tell you what to eat, bro. You know what I'm saying? If you ask me about anything, I'm going to... <laughs> I'm gonna give you. I'm not. I, I'm not a gatekeeper, bro. I'm not. I don't, I don't keep no secrets, but I'll, I'll give it out. So you should feel happy that the fact that people are coming to you. You know. Again, the whole point is to share the knowledge. It's the whole point is to help everyone else grow. Because if you're growing and no one around you is growing, and you're not able to help no one, then it's to no use, to no avail, <laughs> to no avail. Because what? What's it for then? What's it for? For vanity? You know what I'm saying? So you're doing it for vanity, which is nothing wrong with doing it for vanity but at the same time like it's about spreading spreading the information and the love you know and of course as the chosen one positive vibes and that you know people see the positive vibes people see the smile people see the positive outlook you know they want that they want that you know you like you know being a chosen one i feel like it's like it's a drug that everyone wants that no one gets enough of everyone wants that drug bro everyone wants to feel good within themselves and that, but they're not getting it. Everyone wants that positive friend. Everyone wants someone to motivate them. Everyone wants so to be around or to, to communicate with someone who's a, an advancing man. But again, very rare to find that person. Everyone else on a negative vibe, on uh, being so sorry for themselves and, you know, looking down and, <laughs> you feel what I'm saying to you? So it's a lot that comes with being a chosen one, you know, but at the same time, you don't want to attach to none of these things, you know, you don't want to attach to the title of being a chosen one. You want to simply just do your work, you know, help when you can and then keep it pushing. You know, you want to make sure that every single day, every single week, you assess where you are and you're going up. You understand? If you're in the gym, you're pushing this way, bro, next week you need to go up. <laughs> if you're reading, next week you need to go up, read more pages. You know, if you're, whatever you're doing, it's about going up. Simply focusing on ascending. That's all you need to do. Nothing else. That's the secret. You know? So, again, chosen ones. They envy you. They envy the glow. They envy the drip. They envy the style. They envy the... Ah, it's tough, man. But at the end of the day, you have to keep it going. Keep it pushing. You know? A lot of people are going to try to drag you down. A lot of people... Nah. It's, it's not going to work. God's speaking. Speaking through me. It's not going to work. <laughs> you know? Because you see some people, you don't see them. But you can, you, can, you can smell the hate in the air. Like, you can smell the enviness in the air. You know? But it's like, mm, I smell it. 
but I'm gonna keep it pushing regardless. You know, feel what I'm saying to you. So I appreciate you for watching the video. Again, make sure to join the Discord group and that uh, all the chosen ones are in there. People want to progress. The Patreon, I'm gonna where break it down even further. Specific things to do, not to do. You know, what I'm saying to you again. Instagram you can contact me, DM me, anything you need advice with. I'm here to help, bro. I'm just doing my job. Simple as that. Make sure to smash the like button, hit the rest subscribe button.